Intercept form is a form in which we can write a straight line equation that allows us to very quickly find both the x-intercept and y-intercept for the line. Intercept form looks like this. x over a plus y over b equals 1. Neither a nor b can be equal to 0. In this first equation, I have 4x plus 2y equals 8. This is not an intercept form because this is not a 1. The important thing we have to do is we have to turn that 8 into a 1, and we do that by dividing everything in the equation by 8. 8 over 8, of course, is equal to 1. And 4 eighths x can be expressed as x over 2. 2 eighths y can be expressed as y over 4. By doing this little bit of algebra, we have now turned our equation into an intercept form version of the same equation. a is therefore equal to 2. That means our x-intercept is equal to 2, so in my table of values, I can define the x-intercept like this. b is equal to 4, so my y-intercept is 4. We can use algebra and plug x equals 0 and y equals 0 into the original equation to verify that these are indeed the y-intercept and the x-intercept for this line. Example 2 is already mostly written in intercept form, but there is the complication that there is a minus instead of a plus here. I'm going to turn 1 quarter x into x over 4, and I can see that my a is equal to 4. I can put my x-intercept into the table of values. The way to express the minus one-third y as plus y over b is to write plus y over negative 3. Adding a negative is the same as subtracting, and this tells us that our b is not equal to 3, it's equal to negative 3. Again, if we plug x equals 0 and y equals 0 into the original equation, we can verify with algebra that these are indeed the correct y-intercept and x-intercept for this straight-line equation. This is how we can use intercept form, where a or b are not equal to zero, to quickly find the x-intercept and y-intercept of any straight-line equation.